Kashmiri Nama's quest is to answer that one question, which the citizens of India, Pakistan, and even the world are now grappling to answer. What is the cost of Kashmir? I think, but I don't know. All right, sorry. Um, I know that sounded like. I know that sounded like. I never heard that voice before myself. All I can say is that you didn't need to wait for me. You could have started early. <laughs> I've, I've said this, this is not about just those two films or just about the film that you mentioned. This has happened in the past with many films. And every single time it's happened, I mean, we, I have spoken up very openly and said that it should not. Uh, I'm totally against anything being banned. Um, there are films that are banned, even people who ban the films that you're not talking about protest that those, why have these films been banned? So it's just like a tit for tat banning that's going on. <coughs> but um, I genuinely believe, and I have always believed that we should stop treating our audiences as children. You know, we should allow them to grow. We should allow them to be exposed to different kind of ideas, to counter cultures, to counter thinking. Uh, it's very important for the development of any nation, you know, for there to be viewpoints that are not always agreeable by a majority. Uh, and the majority, because you're in cinema, there is no such law that exists where if a film releases, come what may, you have to go and see it. There is no such law. You have the freedom to boycott the film. You have a freedom to spread messages to tell people to boycott the film. But what you don't have is to threaten, you don't have the freedom to go and threaten somebody with grievous bodily harm or break somebody's theater or cause damage in any kind of way to anyone. And that's where, unfortunately, the line has not been drawn very, very clearly enough. <clears throat> we as the film industry are dependent on the CBFC to tell us what is okay and what is not. We've accepted that. Beyond that, once it has been cleared by that board, I think it is up to then the, the government, the INB ministry and the government to, to protect your film and to protect the filmmakers. That's what I've always felt and that's what I feel even, even about these films. <laughs>